Yo, 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 it is your boy, Adam Coe. It's August 23rd, it's a beautiful, beautiful Sunday, and the Giants are 13-16. Yes, that is correct, 13-16, they've won five in a row, five in a row. The Giants are playing great baseball, they really are. Uh, they got kind of handed the win yesterday, though. Um, they D-backs couldn't throw strikes from from their starting pitcher, Zach Gallen, to the, uh, to the end. Uh, their bullpen couldn't as well. They were just walking in runs at the end, and it was kind of kind of frustrating. Um, I could tell by the the, the D backs. If I was a D backs fan, I'd be very frustrated because they just gave us that win, five uh, one win. Giants only had five hits, and they had five runs. You know that's bad. Eight walks. Um, anytime you walk eight people, you're not going to win a game. So, kind of hand the win, but we'll take it. We will take it. That's five straight. Going to, to uh, try to win six in a row to, uh, today in about an hour and a half. Um, against Luke Weaver uh, and trying to sweep the D-backs. First sweep of the year would be, would be great um, going into the Dodgers series and before the trade deadline. So, uh, yeah, so pretty much Tyler Anderson dominated that game. Um, he had the most pitches in the first inning. I think it was 18. And then after that, it was 9, 10, 13, 12. He never got stressed out. Um, he was making these guys look silly. Uh, he They were rolling the ball over, popping a lot of pitches up. Um, he had them off balance almost all night. Um, so it was awesome to see Tyler Anderson first complete game, um, in his career. I think he's only had 76 starts, but that's pretty impressive. Um, a CG nowadays is not nothing, uh, you know, doesn't happen often. So great job, Tyler Anderson. This start this pitching staff, Logan Webb pitches well. The next guy wants to do better and he, they do better. So Trevor Cahill, you're up next, buddy. Um, and it was a CG when he, you give him no runs, no earned runs, one run, Brandon Crawford <laughs> throwing air. Um, and they scored from that, but no one runs, so he pitched flawless. Um, so yeah, five hits, eight walks. Yaz play, man, that play in right field was one of the best plays I've seen in right field. Um, of course, Hunter Pence play uh, in the World Series is better because of the situation, but Yaz was probably more athletic on that play. Um, same spot, he got up, he got up higher than I thought. I saw the picture, um, and it's gonna be the thumbnail today. He got up pretty high, and he jammed into that wall. Uh, he was shaking the wrist a little bit at the end, but looked like he was fine. He stayed in the game, and he's in the lineup tonight, today. So, um, he has, man, just doing everything. Two more runs to, uh, yesterday. RBI uh, walk to get a run in. The guy just plays. He knows how to play. Um, Joey Bart, pff, stay hot, Joey Bart. Uh, our, it wasn't RBI. It was uh, just a double off the top of the wall. Could have easily been a home run. Two more inches up to get his first home run. The guy just hits extra base hits. That's all he does. Hits the ball hard. Um, keep swinging at Joey Bart, and yeah, man, it's fun to watch him. Uh, Steven Duggar, double. Steven Duggar, double. Just keep doing that. We'll be all right, Steven Duggar. Um, I'm rooting for the kid. I really am. I've always liked him. Uh, he just, he's get, he's got injured a couple times when he was, he kind of did what Slater did. Slater, he was kind of hot one year. I think it was 2018, and uh, he had, he was getting a lot of hits, and he got hurt. Um, so it's kind of frustrating, uh, but Hopefully he can stay healthy and, and stay as a as a platoon piece for us. Big news today as well. Probably the biggest news uh, in a while is Hunter Pence designated for assignment. Kind of saw it coming. Not at didn't see it happening today. Um, I saw it like two weeks ago maybe uh, when he was really struggling before the home runs. But I mean they're not playing around here. Um, if you're not hitting, better watch out because you will be you'll be flipped or sent down. Or designated, and I think Pablo's got to watch himself. Pablo's batting sixth or seventh today. Uh, DH, I think he's batting sixth. Um, DH, that's pretty much all he could do is DH and play first right now. So watch your back, Panda. I, I hope you're in the batting cage uh, right when you heard that news. I bet he was in the batting cage trying to kind of, trying to work on a swing because he could be next. Because um, everybody else is hitting. Everybody else on this roster is hitting. So if you're not one of those that are hitting, watch your back. So. I hope we can stick around and keep Panda around. I've always liked Panda. Obviously, he's the fan favorite, but Pence couldn't do it. And if he, he wasn't hitting the lefties, so, I mean, he, he has two home runs against lefties, but that's all he could do. His defense is not as good as it used to be. Um, so, it sucks, man. Hopefully, he find his, finds a spot somewhere else um, that he could play and hopefully get his career going once again like he did last year with the Rangers. But, hey, it is what it is. The Giants are not going to mess around anymore. This is a different organization, different um, different staff. So 
they're not gonna mess around if you're not contributing next man up so is what it is uh, we also made a, a little small move we traded with the D back or the uh, the Rays sorry the Tampa Bay Rays Daniel Robertson who was originally drafted high first round picked by the um, by the athletics uh, out of high school so he has some talent. I've seen him. He has. He's getting a lot more, a, lot, a little more pop um, as he goes on in his career. He's only 26. He uh, feels like he's been around forever, but he's only 26. He's going to be sent to San Sacramento, and we could definitely use him later on. Uh, he played well last couple years with the Rays. Good pinch hitter. Uh, plays every every infield spot, which is which is a, a plus. And I do like him. So um, not going to be a game changer, but a guy that you you can put in there um, in platoon and kind of play every position. So. Not a bad move. Uh, low risk, high reward. Um, going on to today, Luke Weaver, like I said, against Trevor Cahill. Good thing about today, Trevor Cahill's only gone four innings, three innings, two innings. He hasn't went far in the game yet. Um, and hopefully he can go five today, maybe six. But if not, the good thing is, is our bullpen is completely ready for anything. Um, everybody should be ready and everybody should be available, especially with the CG yesterday and seven innings the night before. So everybody should be ready. And if we go four or five innings with Cahill with one or zero runs, that's okay. Put in our guys. Put in Garcia, Arlen Garcia. Put in Watson. Put in Rodgers. Put in, you know, this might be a good day for Gott if we have a lead. Um, I want to get Trevor Gott in there again. Um, hopefully we get a big lead and he can just hop in and throw an inning or two. Get his confidence going. So, yes, that's all I got. Player of the game. I'm going with Alex Dickerson again. He didn't really get a chance yesterday. He hit one ball really hard in the left field. It looked like it was going to be a double and David Peralta made a good play. Um, and he got walked twice. So RBI, RBI walk. But if they pitch to him, let's see what happens. Okay. I think he's batting 209. Um, but I think he's way better hitter, like I said yesterday. He's a way better hitter than 209. He's more like a 270 hitter. Uh, it can happen quick with the short season. He hasn't had many at-bats. If he goes three for three today, the average can go to 250. So um, Alex Dickerson, let's get it, buddy. Uh, let's go. Let's get that sweep. Uh, Trevor Cahill, get his going. Bullpen, hold it down. Play some defense. Score early. Just keep doing what you're doing. Uh, just, I'm, I'm, I'm excited. I'm, I'm, I got my broom out. It's, it's sitting next to the couch today while I watch the game. Um, I'm excited. The game's starting a little bit, and uh, I will post the, I will officially post the prospect video tonight. All right. So get ready for that, and let's get a sweep going into that Dodger series. Okay. We, um, it's gonna be home now. So they're coming to our house. Our fans are ready. Um, and we're ready to beat beat LA. Okay, if we can get two out two from the Dodgers, that'd be awesome. And that's that's really going to go into the trade deadline. Um, it's it's going to be hard for Farhan. It's kind of what we happened last year. We had that really uh, hot uh, month right before the trade deadline, and we didn't sell as much as we should have. Uh, we didn't we didn't sell Mad Bum or Will Smith, but it end up it all ended up working um, in in the long run. So um, I expect them to be busy, but I don't know how busy they're going to be. And I don't think they know either. Uh, it really depends on the next three or four games. All right. That's all I got. Go Giants, guys. Go Giants. Keep it hot. Six in a row today. Go Giants.